trawling along this rock wall, we're going to put him out of his misery and that'll go nice with our snapper and bream. So what you got to do, you see the eyes and the body meets, you just got to go and it instantly turns white, see? And that means it's totally... You! Keep it tight. Jack's into a big, big something. Keep the line tight, Jack. Don't slacken that line. Keep. Lost it. squid down and I've caught this I'm pretty sure it's a snapper I've never caught a snapper before so I'm really happy right now I'm just gonna that, that perfectly caught right in the drawer of the mouth he had huge head shakes so yeah beautiful fish whoa whoa, whoa, whoa. you wanna go in I said I don't want to put hooks on it. It's still recording. So I just hooked onto the bream here on the other rod that was in. It's getting pretty hectic at the moment. We'll let this guy go. Let him go? Yep. Snapper here. This guy's definitely bigger than the one I think we got this morning. It's definitely fatter. Get the hooks. He absolutely smashed it. And then a few seconds. Oh, he's oh. oh, Nice one. Snapper. Right, so here's that beautiful snapper. I caught, it's actually a pink snapper. It's got some beautiful blue dots there. Shines in the water. So, put him on here. No, definitely not. not and here's another keeper. Okay, so right here, so now, throw him back to the 
So, there he is. Beautiful. Get it on the photo. Um, hang on. Maybe roll his through. Um, with squid, you're actually meant to turn them inside out, but I'm still struggling a bit on how to do that. If you have any ideas, please put that in the comments, because I'm finding it very difficult. So that's the squid there. Oh, just chopped it up. What I'm going to do now is I've got the bream, got loads, we cut them up into little fish bites. We've got loads of it here. I'm just going to shove it all in into the flour. Real simple today, we're just going to go flour, then egg, and then just sprinkle a bit more flour over the top. Alright, so I'm just going to put the calamari 
into the pan now. Pan's hot enough. And then my dad's just putting the brain into the other one. Alright, so I'm going to give the squid a taste now. A bit of the tentacles, you can see there, the purple. Beautiful colour. That is really nice. It's the first time we've actually tried egg and flour. Usually we do egg and breadcrumbs, but we don't have any breadcrumbs. But that is just as good. That's like so good. Alright, I'm going to give the bream a taste now. I'm going to put some lemon over this piece here, I just tried it. Drown it in lemon, so good. So this is the brain. That is so nice, the lemon definitely really helps.